Hey guys, so welcome back to the whole entire vlog. It's my possibly and welcome back. I feel like it's been so long for me to not vlog at all. I've been procrastinating, just having a mental health problem. I am back with you guys. I'm so excited for this vlog. I just got back from school. I showered actually, so. So basically, there's nothing much that is going to happen today. And I don't know, I just feel so lazy to vlog, but I want to because tomorrow is a exciting day for me. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna vlog that for you guys, you know. Yeah, oh my god, I miss vlogging so, so much. But before I start into the whole entire vlog, make sure to subscribe and follow me on Instagram and give this vlog a shoot, 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 thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And yeah, let's get started into the whole entire vlog, okay? This is my OOTD. I'm just wearing this sweater and a very gray outfit, after school outfit. <laughs> guys i'm waiting for my doctor to call me and i don't think that i can actually record 4 40 p.m right now i just got back from the dentist my teeth hurt so bad i mean like the Doctor tightened my teeth. Cindy, sakit gila. Yeah, I just wanna go to sleep. I don't have the mood to vlog. Yeah, I have to go to sleep, but I have to do my homework. Uh, oh my God. Okay. It is currently 8 p.m. and I prayed just now. I'm actually feeling so weak right now. I don't feel like talking. My teeth hurt so freaking bad. Like I don't even know. But right now I am going to do my homework that I have for today. If I I forgot what homework do I have do I have so I have to do my homework even though I'm lazy. Oh and by the way guys I drew this for um Sunny I'm not a good artist but I tried. So I'm gonna do my science homework obviously science always at the homework I'm gonna do it. Oh I forgot my pencil box. Oh my god my pencil box is very dirty already, what the heck. I'm actually very lazy to go shower. I think I'm not gonna go shower because I'm feeling so lazy. Why am I like this? <laughs> the next day and i'm getting ready for school um i'm so sleepy like you guys have no oh my god i have pj today so that's why i'm just wearing this today is the big day which i'm so sad at. i'm not gonna bring y'all to school actually so i'll see you guys after school actually so can you guys hear me what i'm talking about because i'm mumbling i need to fix my tudong i had a few problems just now finding my tudong i lost my tudong but right now i'm okay i'll see you guys after school i'm so sad i can't i can't even smile before i go to school it's currently 6 40 a.m turn off all my lights before i go to school and I put this in my pocket wait how do i put this all right oh my god so hot, okay lah, I will see you guys uh, after school. Hey guys, so I'm back home. It is 12.30 p. 
p.m. right now and um, I just got back from school. School was pretty tiring and my teeth hurt so freaking bad. I cannot believe that today is actually the big day which I'm very sad about that. So what a nice camera angle. I'm very hungry because I cannot eat just now at school. My gigi sake again. So I'm gonna go eat and yeah I don't know why nowadays I'm very lazy to vlog. very sleepy and I don't think that my brain is moving right now but I still want to talk with you guys and explain a few things to you guys about what's been going on in my social life lately oh my god so okay I'm so straightforward you know so you guys know that I love social medias I love my Instagram I love my YouTube channel I love everything about social medias I expose almost everything on my social media I expose my lifestyle I expose my family almost every single thing oh my god my pets but one day you know TikTok one day I created a TikTok account because every Everybody was so much of addicted to it. Even my sisters bought TikTok account, even my friends bought TikTok account and I was like, you know what, I'm just going to try it because I did musical we you know back then. I regret it. But now I was like, you know what? I'm just going to try to create a TikTok account and I got very addicted with TikTok. Almost every day I will do TikTok videos, I will dance like crazy on TikTok. It was so fun and it was was just for fun but something bad happened if you guys follow me on tiktok i posted a lot of like crazy awkward weird videos of me i created this one tiktok video and something happened so i'm gonna explain it to you guys right now so i created a tiktok video thing and i danced like crazy i don't have the dance skills at all but it was just for fun and then one day i opened my phone and the notification by the notification from tiktok all the notification is negative i was like wow okay 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 i don't know i don't know what to say that time i was um, i was hurt because i suddenly received comments but it's a positive but this time i got a lot of hate literally people saying my body is so skinny i look like a face skeleton i look like an alien and a lot of things and it hurt my feelings so you guys don't even know i usually i i don't really care about what people think or say about me but this one it hurt so freaking bad i got a lot of hate in my tiktok video went viral and bila I tutup my phone sikit, ada notification from TikTok Tutup sikit my phone, ada notification from TikTok Like it went seriously viral I was like, wow, wow, I'm a f famous TikToker right now I was pretty happy about that But one day, my sister sent me a like a Twitter account They post my TikTok video on the Twitter account and I was like, shit, it's on Twitter like people kept saying that I'm skinny and blah blah I look like a many queen and people just <sighs> I just receive a lot of hate just for that video like what the hell I never expect my TikTok video to be viral I couldn't admire than my sisters I was so depressed, sad, angry, smits negative feelings and I wanted to be positive but I just can't I I thought more jadi positive because I was so scared if something bad will happen or something I couldn't master the be motivated because I was I was afraid I pernah kena ni tapi in real life at school and right now jadi balik so I feel just traumatized like how can someone be so cruel I thought everybody everybody was so nice in this world but it's not so you just cannot trust anyone even your closest one I'm very sorry Cash tapi you just cannot trust anyone anyone in this world i know it's crazy guys like i just cannot believe even insta famous commented on my tiktok account which is super duper duper crazy i want to feel happy but i'm not i want to feel sad but i think i'm sad i don't know i just 
I got very depressed with it because I got a lot of hate comments on my Instagram, on my sister's Instagram account. People kept DM DMing my sisters, um, how can your sister be that ugly? How can I be that ugly? How can your sister I to be that ugly? And commenting a lot of hate comments and I was so depressed, like I want to kill myself guys. But no. Uh, Iman, I quit, don't worry. And I was so depressed and sad and then I created a quote account. Go follow my quote account, it's quotes by Iron Fuzzly. And I literally expressed all my feelings there and I feel pretty good. I tulis the quotes, I cried so bad. Like, I'm not trying to be dramatic or something, but I don't expect all of this TikTok tragedy to be to happen in my life and I feel embarrassed about all this shit, all this tragedy, the viral thing, you know, and I regret. I regret doing TikTok. Even though it's fun and I love to do TikTok dances, I regret doing it, you know. A single TikTok video, I went viral and I sneered and suck it. And that's why I deleted TikTok. You guys have been asking me a lot and Asking me why I was sad and a lot of things, a lot of things. Mostly quarantine pasal why I deleted my TikTok account. I know some of the people out there loved my TikTok account, but I'm very sorry, guys. I just I had to delete my TikTok account because I just don't want to hurt myself just because of TikTok, just because of social media. You know, you guys know social media is very very toxic. And right now, the person deleted my TikTok video on the Twitter. My sisters helped me a lot. Like, I'm very grateful to have my sisters. But I, I still feel scared and traumatized about the viral accident. I feel so traumatized to do what I love to do. I just feel so scared to expose myself. Which I love to do. Like, I love to expose myself on social media. But right now, I just feel scared and traumatized to do everything. All my confidence just... Like fell down. I was so confident and usually I don't care what other people think or say about me but this time it hurts so freaking bad. Like kalau korang nak benci, I korang benci je lah. I tak yalah nak comment dekat tempat orang lain. Dekat my sister's Instagram. Just spamming them, you know, it's very annoying and it hurts. Uh, this is a lesson for me for 2020. Don't expose too much on social media. Even though you love social media, you just can't trust anyone on social media. If you want to be a influencer, YouTuber, or whatever social media influencer you wanna, like you wanna be in the future, please, please, please be strong. Please make sure that you can deal with all the hate and make sure that you can deal with the hate out there. Ada je orang bunuh diri because of this cyber bullying thing. So make sure you have you have the strong heart to deal with all of the hate. And I'm very grateful that I am strong enough to manage this hate thing. So even though the person deleted my TikTok video on the Twitter, but I still feel traumatized and scared and scared to start my social media life back. I, I feel relieved that the my viral TikTok thing the hilang the Twitter tapi I still feel so scared and traumatized. So I hope you guys understand. I'm very sorry for those who love my TikTok videos. Some of them I had to delete my TikTok account because I rather I rather mm. not do what I love to do than diri sendiri sakit. I take this as a lesson for me to not expose myself too much on social media you know take care of myself on social media yeah but go follow my instagram iron fuzzly and quotes by iron fuzzly because i will be sharing a lot of informa information about my life on the quotes by iron instagram okay i don't know what i should do right now i'm a very sleepy oh oh guys um another thing every day while i got the hate because of my TikTok video went viral on Twitter. <sighs> I have to act like I'm happy every day, which I wasn't very happy. I was sad. I cried every night. I cried every time. I was so sad at school. Semua apa pelik kalau kenapa I macam depressed why I was sad. I'm a happy person. I'm a very positive person. Person. This tragedy happened. Oh my god. Macam sakit gila hati aku eh You guys tak tahu macam mana sakitnya 
serious and it hurt to pretend that I'm happy but I'm not I have to build my confidence back you know, I have to build everything back thank you so so much for all the sweet uh up at the positive the ends from you guys and i appreciate it so 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 freaking much um i love you guys so so much literally thank you so so much for everything yeah why am i so emotional right now i am emotional so i slap a bit just now but um right now i am going to be doing my homework that i have for today and then yang hari lepas lepas yang i tak datang because I the mom so I tak be sekolah. I'm going to do that. We all hate doing our homework. We know that. I know that. Everybody knows that. Um, but we just we're going to do it no matter what. the time I'm so sad it I like oh my god watch till the end to know what has been going on right now um I cannot wait to show you guys the new thing because uh, currently my dad is picking up the new thing you know so I'm very sad it but right now I am going to transfer everything that I have on my computer to this Backup driver that I have. Yeah, I'm gonna do that and I'm so sad. Hello, Papa. Yeah. Uh, transfer the card yang uh, USB kecil tu ke yang blue color? Uh, yang uh, USB yang macam kotak tu. Oh, okay, 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 bye. Okay guys, so subscribe to all. But the thing has arrived. I'm so excited. But before that, I gotta clean my desk because it's like so freaking messy right now. Look at that. Oh my god. So I'm gonna clean them. Okay, let's do it. Done. and if you guys don't know the new thing is actually this one um i got a new one because if you guys recognize my last one it was black but this one it was white and i don't much um like a neonish inside it's very very pretty i cannot wait to add it on because my last my last computer um it was black if you guys recognize this one it was black it was so hard to edit on it because like that lama can so it's very stressful but i got a new one i cannot wait to edit on it like oh my god finally i got a new one so yeah my dad is helping me to set up every single thing and i have everything all my youtube things all my bar bara inside this backup drive you know and it's literally it's like so new look at this that is downloading everything mostly i use my computer to edit only and i think that's all it do you guys know what is on my mind right now i'm thinking about food i'm so hungry Ooh, the lighting is so nice it's literally empty i don't know what should i download oh my god <laughs> I still have everything already and I don't know what else should I download seriously guys Yay, I got my new computer That is the thing for today, this is the surprise I cannot wait to edit on my new computer Because you know my last time that I edit I might get the problems My computer shut down while I was editing my videos lah My computer hang tiba lah And it's just 
uh, it's so stressful if I not edit sometimes I just want to give up bila I edit my videos and just it's so annoying and stressful but yeah I got it I just wanted to thank my dad for all of this setup I love you so so much and I'm giving away my old computer to my older sister I'm very tired of talking guys seriously I want to download like a lot of like thousands of apps but thank you so much for watching this whole entire vlog I hope you enjoyed following me through getting my new computer journey thank you so, so much I love you guys literally so freaking much yeah I think that's all okay and I'll see you guys next time bye